It's October 17th. First day out on my Fisher E99s, old school. Looking for a rabbit ears past miracle. It's crazy driving up here, how dry as a bone it can be when you reach rabbit ears pass and there's snow. Oh, hello. Hello. So I quickly switched over to the S-Bound 98s before I got far from my car because it's kind of a break breakable crust and I'm appreciating the wide tip and uh, the round flex for keeping these tips above the snow for the most part. Figured that'll be a lot more efficient today. And if I come to a downhill, I'll be able to ski down it. Those uh, E99s. I just got them used at Recycle Sports in Frisco. Um, they're a 215 length. So I got them because I felt like they'd be really good for kicking along on flats, um, especially on a snowmobile trail. But for today's snow, these S Bound 98s seem to be the ticket. I just love Rabbit Ears Pass. This is about two hours and 20 minutes from here. But uh, it's so great, get so much snow. I mean, I don't think there's anywhere else in Colorado on October 17th. Maybe, maybe we'll creek pass. Or I could go and ski along like this. The snow today is everywhere from uh, powder to ice crystals that form on top of it when it gets really cold to glop to uh, crust. This part right here is kind of powdery. Here it's crusty. Watch out, good luck. And probably powdery again right here. I don't know if you can see the frost on that. I'm hiking back up to uh, do a great line I just skied. So I know it's worth doing twice. Start just slightly higher this time. Good one. Easy. At what? Watch out, bro. Oh, nice. You can hear the changes in the snow conditions here and there. But most of that run was powder. Oh, Jakob. He's a good dog.